Seas now, where there is a sharp backlash against the Vatican after the Catholic Church condemned the idea of ordaining women by putting female priests in a similar category as pedophiles. Here's Jim Shuto now. It was billed as part of the Vatican's tough new response to abuse, formalizing rules including defining possession of child pornography as abuse and making it easier to defrock offending priests. But many were astonished at the inclusion of a new crime right alongside pedophilia, ordaining women priests. The Vatican made it clear the two were not the same, calling abuse, quote, more grave. But just the association sparked outrage. Bridget Mary Meehan is one of five American women ordained as part of a Catholic reform movement and excommunicated by the Vatican. They're equating both as criminal acts. Therefore, this is an example of misogyny and patriarchy and really taking on women as the enemy in the church. So why would the church pair these issues, pedophilia and women priests? Is it just bad PR or is the Vatican sending a message? Some argue the Vatican is pushing back against suggestions that the solution to the abuse crisis is to open up the priesthood, ordaining women and allowing male priests to marry. We asked the Archbishop of Washington, D.C. Is there any reason to think that there was a deliberate message here? Celibacy is not the problem. Uh, and so for those who want to couple the two, uh, I think that's more an agenda of theirs than a reality of the situation. The reality for the church, though, is another lost opportunity to move beyond the scandal. Jim Shuto, ABC News, London.